Welcome back to Harvest Moon A Wonderful Life. I have gone ahead quite a bit compared to the last episode. Actually, I think we're in like spring year seven or something. Now we're in full year eight. So almost an entire year has passed since the last episode. <laughs> Just because I wanted to speed things along a little bit. Honestly, I just i am kind of getting a little bit bored. So <laughs> I, I kind of want to just progress. Um, so yeah, there is that. Today I do have some plans. So at least I do have some things to be getting on with, which is also why I wanted to speed it along because the more I do that, the more I'll be able to, to do in an episode because there'll be like more things to do, right? So like that would be cool. As you can see, we got lots of produce growing from the trees and everything. Also, it was also because I wanted my dillions. I was working on getting dillions and without the dillions, I wouldn't really be able to hybridize or like do any of that stuff. So that was also another thing that I was like working on and it was taking forever and some of my dillions wilted and I wasn't having a great time with that. So uh, that also kind of like made me progress a little bit. Also today is a van day and there's also some cutscenes that I'm going to try and trigger as well. There's not like a massive amount of cutscenes for us to like trigger now but um like <laughs> there isn't that many for this year anyway but there will be a couple and I'm gonna try them out so hopefully we'll get those as well but we'll just like have to see how it goes because cutscenes in this game are very random and <laughs> you don't always get them so it just depends on how lucky you are right but yeah this is kind of the situation with my with my trees and like my plants and everything right now constantly picking up stuff from my fruit trees because I got so many of them and I've actually got so much produce now as well. If you look in my inventory, I have like 74 apples, 64 bananas, all my fruits are just like crazy amount, apples there, peaches, I'm nearly maxed out on my peaches, I've been selling some as well, I got like 55 golden eggs, it's ridiculous, <laughs> my, um, the amount of produce that I've got is insane, it's so much and it's like, it's, it's more than you would ever need, like I never would need this amount, I got 62 fertilized eggs, 32 brown milk, 78 app ages like it does all the fruits so much i got 10 golden wool and they sell for like 6k each i think right so like that's a lot of money right there i got 56 dunks and 55 durums 96 made rums so it's like i'm literally like i'm literally rich and like there's nothing to spend my money on either so i don't even know why i pick up all these items anymore i think i've got like everything from the hybrid trees now like you know the trees the hybrid trees i'm pretty sure i've got all the produce from all of them now at the point that i'm at in the game so i'm literally just picking them up just for the sake of it and like there's not actually a real reason for for collecting all of this stuff anymore because <laughs> i just don't need it i don't need the money i don't need the produce so i'm just doing it just because just because it's there and just because it gives me something to do really so <laughs> That's like the only reason. I've been eating like the stuff around as well, like the stuff around town and that kind of stuff, you know, like the uh, the wild plants and that kind of thing. So I've been doing that a little bit too. But there we go. It's the last of those. And there's more up there. Look, there's even more. I'm not even growing anything right now because uh, I was kind of like, didn't really need anything. I think I've got everything apart from like the ones we haven't created yet. There are a couple of third generation uh, crops that I hadn't that I haven't created and the reason for that is because I needed dillions so I was basically just working on getting a ton of dillions and stuff and that was basically it son don't go oh I wanted to talk to him but he just kind of he just kind of disappeared he vacated <laughs> but fair enough my I I think I think this cow just gave birth I think so I could probably just like push you into uh, not into there. That's not what I wanted to happen. I wanted to push you into the milk uh, room. I think with the milk processing room, you have to push your cow into it once. And then like every time after that, your cow will like remember to go in there and just like take themselves off and do it automatically. So that's kind of cool. I like that, that that's the thing. You don't even have to, to milk it anymore. It's kind of a pointless upgrade really, because like you can just kind of milk your animals yourself. But uh, I guess 
guess it saves time, I suppose. Like, I would have preferred a different upgrade for, like, the last upgrade than that one, but uh, I guess it's better than nothing, you know? So, <laughs> it is what it is. I'm just trying to, like, make my animals um, nice and clean. Hello. Good morning, Dad. Hello, son. How are you? I think that being a farmer takes a lot more than just being able to, like, all the animals. I mean, yeah is hard work. You gotta, you gotta want to do it, right? Adults don't really understand how I feel. Oh, really? I'm kind of curious about being a farmer someday. I don't think he really has like any different dialogue lines, like he's repeating a lot of them. There are places where shearing contests are held. Right, there's like festivals and stuff, but not in this town, sadly. What about this strange item? I got this from Murray, he, he gave it to me. It's amazing that things from the past endure so long. That That's true, that's true. I feel like my, my child sounds very, very wise, wise beyond his years at this point. Do you want some star milk? Hmm, what, for me? Uh, that's right. Thank you, I like that. I'm glad you like it, because, like, that was the purpose of giving it to you. There are all sorts of flavours of milk. There are indeed. Do you want... Let's see, what do I have? I wonder what he would say if I gave him mother's milk. I'm able to identify the different tastes of milk. Right, okay, okay. Does it taste that much different? I wouldn't know. <laughs> I have no idea. All right, let's see, what else do I have? Maybe something that I can show him or something. What do you think he would say to this, like, really gross dish? <laughs> Did you make that? That's right. <laughs> Trying to show off? Not quite yet, Dad. I mean, it's a failed dish. I mean, what, what did you want, want me to say? Do you want an egg? Because eggs are known to contain sal salmonella, it's recommended that it be cooked for about a minute. Wow. My son, he has come come far. He, he is very wise. <laughs> I was not expecting that kind of, like, response. Do you want this music sheet? Do you want? What? What do you want me to do with that? I'm kind of curious about being a farmer someday. Oh, okay, so you don't like music? <laughs> Fair enough. Do you like fish? You want this? Dad, did you catch that? Uh, yeah, piece of cake. <laughs> Ugh, that's no big thing. What? <laughs> Are you mad because I caught a fish? I'm so very confused right now, but okay. Do you want flour? Here you go. What are you going to do with that flour? I don't know. I'm just going to carry it around and just... I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, what? What do you want me to do with that? I'm kind of curious about being a farmer. Okay, he doesn't like tum-tums either, apparently. Uh, what about bird feed? You want some bird feed? I'm not an animal, silly. Are you sure? <laughs> Sometimes I'm not too sure. Watering can? Do you like watering can or something? Hello? Where have you gone, child? You've used that a long time. It's almost like it's part of your body. I, I don't know. I don't know if I'd go that far, but um, okay. What about this milker? I wonder what kind of devices make it work. The person who created it must be amazing. Indeed, they must be. What about fishing pole? I hate it when he crosses his arms and stuff and looks really mad as well. I don't know why, why that's a thing. It's so annoying because you can't talk to them. Even small fish have tremendous pulling power in water. It's pretty amazing. I mean, I guess so. Got a hoe here? What is it? I don't want that. Okay, well, it was worth a try. What about the sickle? Oh no, he's, he's going back to not letting me talk to him. Come back here, child. I'm not finished with you. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? No, I want to show you this. It just keeps using it and I want to I wanna show you. Keep still so I can show you it. <laughs> At least I'm getting some some grass, I guess, but uh, it's not what I was wanting to do. Hello, child. I exist. Why are you ignoring me? <laughs> Please stop ignoring me. I want to show you my amazing sickle. He is not having any of it, is he? He does not want to know. He really doesn't. Here, come back. Why do you not let me show you? That's so annoying. I really wanted to to show him my sickle. But he says no. He says no. Maybe if I catch him at the front like this. 
no oh van shop is open for business i actually want to go to van shop because i want to see if he's got anything new to uh, to sell so we're gonna go and head over there in a second so yeah that would be nice just oh i showed the cow but not my son fine whatever my son doesn't want to know he doesn't want to see my sickle <laughs> For whatever reason. Fine. Whatever. It was a good sickle as well, I tell you. <laughs> but okay. Look how old everyone is. It's kind of sad seeing just like everyone with grey hair. Like Van even has like really grey hair now. So sad. Alright, so he's selling a flower pot. That looks like the only thing he's really selling. Uh, that's a precious vase from a far off foreign land. It's only 3,000. Okay, I'll buy it. I'll be delivering that to you then. Okay. Yay, we got a flower pot. I mean, I was kind of expecting him to sell more, but uh, I guess I'll take it. Sure, there we go. Very nice. Hmm, how about over here? Yes, it looks very nice in the corner. This room would be perfect. Hmm, indeed. I will accept this lovely vase. This is a pretty rare item, so take good care of it. Is it really that rare? I don't know. I'll be on my way then. I hope my wife likes it. <laughs> a random vase in the corner of the room why not i guess why not okay well there we go we got a pretty new vase that's nice it's a shame i don't think you can put flowers in it or anything like you can in other games but i don't think you can in this one so uh yeah that sucks a little bit i don't really have anything i want to sell to be honest with you anything to buy shall we buy some of this stuff like body geyser and that kind of stuff i never actually brought one before so like why not? It's not like I need to be stingy with my money or anything. I got so much of it. Uh, recover stamina, follow directions. Um, okay, shall we eat it? Let's eat it. Glug, 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 glug. Very nice, very nice indeed. Did you like it? It didn't look like he liked it, but whatever. <laughs> too bad, too bad. We got a body geyser. Do they all look the same? Oh, they ha they're different colored bottles. Okay. Good to know, good to know. I think it's kind of a waste of money to actually like buy these, to be honest with you, because it's like, yeah, you do lose stamina in this game, but there's not actually a consequence for actually like having low stamina. Like you just get hungry and that's it. Like you never pass out, like nothing bad ever happens to you for having like low stamina. So like, it's really like not a big deal to have low stamina. So it's really, it's really pointless. This is a very, very pointless item. <laughs> It's literally not even worth buying, like, at all. But whatever, it's fine. I might just buy, like, one more just because... Just because I can. Just because... I am uber rich at this point and I don't have any need for anything. I know it doesn't look like I'm uber rich, but if I sold everything I had, I, I think I would be pretty, pretty rich for sure. So uh, yeah, that's, that's the thing. Okay, we're going to go to the dig site because we haven't actually been to the dig site this year and there probably would be a tablet or like different things for us to find. I don't even think we've been in the dig site like at all this year and there it probably has been upgraded so I would like to go and check that out as well that would be cool look there's Kate she looks so so much older now she looks great hello hello are you well why does mum nag me so much I'm already an adult I don't know I love this season just wandering around and enjoying the scenery it's very nice I love this season indeed it's very relaxing okay I think that's all she's gonna say to me now do you do you want a brush I heard girls like brushes what are you going to do with that I'm gonna brush your hair for you <laughs> like why not do you want some turbo gel I just brought some do you like it I love this season nope she she literally just completely ignored that I had a turbo gel there would you like let's see what I got would you like a star fruit got quite a few of these if you have any veggies I'll give them to my mom that will make her happy for sure I wanted to give it to you, not your mum, but um, okay. You want some milk? Do you like milk? You've got another thing coming if you think I'll eat that. You don't like milk? Why not? Milk's pretty good. <laughs> it's refreshing, very refreshing and good for you, you know? It's good for your teeth and your nails and your hair and lots of other things, I'm sure. So uh, yeah, it's a uh, it's fantastical. Uh, let's see what else I got. Should I give her a horrible dish to see how she reacts to it? Here you go. I hate things like that. Oh, <laughs> well, I know, I wasn't expecting you to like it really. Do you like eggs? 
Oh, that's my favorite. Can I have it? Yeah. She thanks. You're wonderful. So she likes eggs. I didn't. I don't know if I've ever given her an egg before. I have no idea. But uh, like, I, I had a lot. So you're like, you could have them. <laughs> like, I've got no issues with that yeah. whatsoever. Can you find something fun to yeah. do? Look how old Rock is. He's like an old man. Oh yeah. my gosh, it's so sad. I think um, Rock is, his dialogue hasn't changed at all either, but Rock is one of the bachelors that ages the fastest. He gets gray hair like quicker than all of the other males in the game as well. So yeah, it's, it's a little bit... It's a little bit sad. It's a little bit sad that he gets old so quickly. <laughs> My god. Okay, so let's go into the dig site. There's actually supposed to be a cutscene as well that you can trigger, but I think Flora has to like not be in here. I don't know. I don't know if it will happen because like it's a bit random, so we'll just have to we'll just have to see how it goes, right? Um but let's see if we can get some some new produce, some new things from the dig site. It has been expanded, I think. It's uh it's bigger than before. It's really big now, isn't it? I think it can get expanded one more time. I think when we go to the next chapter, it will be expanded once more and then I don't think it will get any bigger than that. That. so yeah like we're definitely getting to the end of this game I think we're on the eighth year I think so I think um there's about two years left if I've calculated it right it's either two or three years so so we're getting close <laughs> found something weird indeed indeed I actually had that already from Murray but I'm wondering if there's like any other different things in the the dig site I'm probably not gonna have time to like dig the whole thing up because like kind of came in here a bit late I was like messing around a little bit so uh yeah there is that too but we'll see how far we get Carter doesn't really look that old I don't think he doesn't really look like he has gray hair at all to be honest and Flora looks pretty good as well considering some of the other character models some of them look worse worse than others <laughs> there are some that have some like really really like old looking hair and they look like they've really aged like way beyond their years <laughs> and then there's some like that look fine like flora and i think muffy looks okay just her hair is just like a little bit lighter i think carter probably looks the best he doesn't look like he's aged at all <laughs> like i don't know what's happened to him he must be like immortal or something <laughs> and i think the characters that already look old you know like sebastian and like uh what's her name the lady that lives in there as well god i can't think of her name right now um but those two also like they don't really change they look exactly the same so yeah that's a that's a thing that happens uh for sure all right let's see what else we got just lying in wait for us i think i've only really found that that strange item so far i haven't found anything else no tablet yet either so uh that's uh surprising i thought that i would have i would have found one by now but nope nothing yet we'll just keep digging though i really hope that we do manage to find it today but if not we can just come back tomorrow and find find something then like hopefully so we'll just like have to we'll have to see how it goes right so yeah all right anything else let's get a digging it's being a bit stingy i dug quite a bit and didn't get anything one of these a pretty ore so nothing nothing too crazy there i guess where is this tablet we must find them all i mean you don't get anything for doing it i just i don't know why i just like to collect them i suppose <laughs> just because just because why not i suppose all right what have we got here just something something red is flora gone flora's gone okay so it's possible that the cutscene may trigger there's a cutscene with flora and katie it just depends on whether it's in this game because this game has not as many cutscenes as the special edition version so it's always like one of those things where it's like hard to tell whether that cutscene was in this game or if it's just just a special edition so um yeah we'll, we'll just have to see i'll just check anyway to see if um see if something see if something pops up all right there we go we are done it's enough for today multi i know i i've done a good job i've done a good job all right let's go out and show 
car to the goods, even though we we really haven't found anything. I didn't find any tablets or anything, and I know for a fact I haven't found it in this chapter. So uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. I don't know like what's happened there. I don't know if we're going to get this cutscene. It looks like no, we're not going to get the cutscene. Seems completely random, so it's like it could pop any time. So. I don't know, we might not even see it, but like, I do plan to play the girl version and when we do play the girl version, I'm hoping that we'll get to see all the ones we've missed because I didn't even see the the cutscene of like the harvest goddess either. I don't think they're like in this game. I really haven't seen them, but there is cutscenes with the sprites, the harvest sprites, where they talk about finding wonderfuls and then there's like four different cutscenes with them. But yeah, I haven't found them in this game. Although to be honest with you, the harvest goddess is not in this game. Anyway, I don't know why she's not in this game. Like, they talk about her, but she's not really in the game, so it's a bit weird. I feel like they, like, didn't have time to put everything into this game or something, so yeah, it's a, it's a little bit sad. I'm gonna stalk Van as well because... I think there might be a cutscene with him as well in Romana's, so I want to check for that as well, so I haven't checked that in a while, so we we will do that for sure. I just want to check something else real quick, so if we just like pop into one of these houses a second, I just want to see if anything pops up if we just go in and just go out. I don't think that this is in the game, but I just like want to check. <laughs> None of the houses are letting me in. I wanted to see if there was a cutscene with um with the Sam lady because she's standing by the well. I have a feeling that it's probably not gonna work, but like I'm just gonna I'm just gonna check anyway. But uh, yeah, I don't think it's gonna, I don't think it's a thing in this game. There's a cutscene with um, Samantha and, um, what's her name, Chris? But yeah, like, I don't think they included it in this one. You like go into one of the houses and then come out and it's supposed to, supposed to trigger. But nope, it's not happening. Look how old Marlin looks. Oh no, his black hair is all completely turned grey. Oh no, not hot, not cold, my kind of season man you've seen better days man you've got old you're an old fogey <laughs> that's crazy and wally looks wally looks normal wally hasn't changed much to be honest with you maybe it's because he's like a very athletic person so like i think like athletic and fit people probably like don't age as fast most likely so <laughs> i know i know it's also like a genes factor as well genetics also play a part in it but being fit and healthy i think does affect like your your like life and how long you live for and all that stuff so i'm sure i'm sure that that maybe plays a part in it possibly so <laughs> I guess it could kind of make sense I suppose all right I got a little bit of gray hair but it's only like the tips of my hair so I, I'm not really like that bad just yet so <laughs> that's kind of cool at the same time all right we're gonna go see if there, there anything happens with Vaughn it might not but we're gonna check anyway so just to just to see because I haven't really been checking cutscenes very much recently so I just want to see if I can trigger any at all, so we'll have to see. Let's see if uh, anything happens here. I'm hoping so, but it's not a guarantee, so nope. <laughs> nothing there at all so yeah I'm a bit disappointed all right well there's one more location to check I guess I could go back in one more time just to see if anything happens here but I don't think it will I think that's it like it would have popped already so nope it's so annoying to get cutscenes to to trigger in this game like I swear to god it's so frustrating but um yeah that's that uh, there is one more thing that I could possibly try so I'm going going to I'm going to do that and uh, it's with my child so are you going into the bar oh my god you don't look you don't seem old enough to go into the bar Hugh I'm actually surprised that he goes into the bar to be honest I didn't think he would let's see what he says hello do you need something I love spending time here good drinks and music are you really old enough <laughs> you like to come here too maybe he's an adult now I don't know that's kind of kind of crazy to think that Hugh, that little old child right at the beginning of the game is now going into the blue bar and like buying drinks for himself. Like how crazy is it to to think like 
that like that's just like so mad to think like how far things have come in this game it really does feel like the whole game progresses alongside you which is like really cool look at all the fruit it's just like never ending <laughs> the fruit just never goes it's just there all the time until the end of time all right let's see if anything happens here with our child i think we might have to wait till muffy leaves muffy's in here i don't want to see a messy room are you tidying our son's room I wonder if our son has a girl he likes. I wonder too. Maybe not in this town. Do you think so? I don't know. I wonder what boys his age are into these days. I don't know, you could read his diary. <laughs> it's gotten so nice and cool now. It has indeed, the weather is nice, so my appetite increases. I've gotta watch my weight though. Okay, I would never have believed I'd live like this. I think that's like it. I don't, I think she's just like, repeating dialogue here so i don't think she's gonna say anything else about like our son but it's nice that she had a few lines there it's kind of nice that she she had something to say so that was cute very very cute indeed we just have to wait for her to leave maybe she'll leave at like nine o'clock but yeah we're gonna hopefully see a cutscene in here too that'd be awesome nope she does not want to leave my son's not in here either so uh yeah, we'll have to wait for him to come in as well. Maybe it's like 10 o'clock or something. I'm not too sure. That's even if it triggers in the first place because getting things to trigger in this game is not easy, as you know. So uh, yeah, where even is my son? Maybe he is in the kitchen. Shall we go check, see what he's doing? Oh yeah, I forget this doesn't lead to the kitchen. And there's my vase in there too. We have our lovely vase. Nope, son's not in the kitchen either. Let's check the fridge situation. I have been restocking it. They haven't really been like eating anything that's like, you know, really like hard to obtain or anything like that. So it's been like, it's been pretty easy to to replace stuff so it's all good oh here you are son what are you doing i'm kind of curious about being a farmer i see what nothing just something on your face that's all <laughs> you know how it is i wish i could change my carpet i think it just like kind of changes as you like progress through the story but in in harvest moon um the girl version of this game you can actually change all the flooring out and like all the carpets out or, like whenever you want but yeah you you can't in this game so it kind of sucks a little bit what's he doing he can't make make up his mind where he wants to go he's very unsure he doesn't know where he's going you want to look at cody's statue yeah i would too it's a it's a unique piece a unique art piece for sure all right finally let's see if this works then i don't know if it will but we're gonna go check anyways to to see what happens all right oh yeah it actually triggered yay <laughs> progress we actually got something to trigger <laughs> Yay! I've been trying to get this one to trigger for a while, so I'm happy about that. So, hello, son. What are you doing? What are you doing? Get out of my room! So, like, something weird was going on with, like, him and the teddy bear. He was, like, lying on the floor and the teddy bear was, like, moving. Very weird, very weird. <laughs> and then you just get kicked out and that's literally it. So, it's, it's like, the shortest cutscene ever, but it exists. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that, that was something, I suppose. <laughs> I think that's it though. I don't think there's anything else I can trigger tonight. So we're going to do some hybridizing now. So I think I'm pretty much done with uh, with stuff and not like, oh no, I can't go in there because Takakura is, uh, is sleeping. No, I'll have to go there in the morning. That's okay. Let's go check on the chickens. Make sure they have some food. They do not. So I should definitely feed them. It takes such a long time to like, like, you know, scroll through all my items now because of like, how many items I've got but uh yeah it wasn't actually I wasn't actually that far away from the chicken food so that's not too bad but there you go my little chickens they're all happy the cows are all outside so I don't need to worry about them although they do need like washing I really haven't like been washing them that much I really should but it's fine all right let's go to to bed go into the next day and I'm gonna see if I can do some hybridizing that would be really cool I'm just gonna sleep one more time it's 5 a.m it's really early so yeah we need to we need to speed this up just a little bit all right 11 a.m that seems fine that seems 
seems pretty good to me actually so that's awesome and we're gonna go and do some hybridizing and I'm gonna save it because I only have a certain amount of dillions and I also need them for cooking as well so I'm gonna like make a little save before we do anything here just so like we don't lose the produce or anything like that because that would be bad right that would be very bad okay so for this for crop number 11 we would need a a deep which is like the strawberry thing and we would also need a dillion which is why I got tons of these dillions. It took me forever to get these dillions as well. As like I said, they kept wilting and they kept dying and it just like, I was just not having a good time. It was, I was pulling my hair out trying to grow these damn things. <laughs> We're actually on the ninth of four now. So I literally only has like one um, season to get through. And then I think we would be going into the new chapter. At least I think so, which would be... Um, I, I think chapter five. Yeah, I think chapter five. We're on chapter four. So I think I'll be going on chapter five and there's six chapters in the game. So we're getting there <laughs> slowly but surely. I made a funky plant and there we go. Here is plant number 11. Oh my, that looks very <laughs> weird. I don't know what to make of that thing. I'm gonna call it pop. I don't know what to call it. So we're gonna go with that and it's cute. And I don't know, maybe this thing pops. Yeah, I don't think I've called anything pop before. No, I haven't. So that will have to do. We're going to call it that. Awesome. And it worked first time as well. So I'm very happy with that. All right, let's check to see what the next crop is that we need. There's only three more that we have to create for the uh, third generation crops. So, so there's really not too many left. So I'm very happy about that, that we're nearly done. We've nearly done all of them. Um, a candy and what was it? A Katie? A, a Katie and a candy. <laughs> I'm going crazy, losing my mind. Candy is this one. So these two here, I've saved it. So if it does mess up, I'll just roll back the save because I've only got two Katie's actually. So I may need them. I don't actually know. We'll just have to, we'll have to see how it goes. I got lucky with the first one. So hopefully we get lucky again. Nope, that one didn't work. Great. I'll have to retry it. Ah, there we go. Third time lucky. <laughs> right? So that's awesome. Yay. I thought I was doing the wrong combination for a second, but that is rare crop number 17. And I used a Katie and a candy. So that's that written down. Now we just have to think of a name for it. So let's see what this thing looks like. Oh, okay. <laughs> It kind of looks like a caterpillar with like a weird spike on it or it looks like a piece of poo. <laughs> it literally looks like someone just like took a dump. <laughs> just they had something spiky in their diet. <laughs> I don't know what it was. And it just looks so gross. It looks horrible. I don't like this one. It's probably the most this is the most like least appealing looking crop I have ever seen. Would you eat that? Like, be honest, would you re would you actually eat that? Because I don't think I would. <laughs> it looks so gross. <laughs> no thanks. Shall we call it gross? I feel like we should call it gross. It, it looks disgusting. There's not enough letters, there's two S's. Let's just, wait, I know, let's call it rank. <laughs> <laughs> it's so it's so disgusting i'm gonna call it rank there you go because <laughs> rank is also a slang word for like really gross as well so you can also use it for like rank as in like rank number one or rank number two uh, but you can also use it as like really gross um so that's the thing i don't know if that's like english slang or something like i'm not i'm not sure if it is or not but just in case you didn't know what it was <laughs> okay radisa i've got three of them and candy which i think i actually have quite a few so yeah i'm i'm ready to i'm ready to combine these and uh let's just hope that it doesn't take too long and we can get this is going to be rare crop number 22 so that's nice radisa and candy let's write that down and then we're gonna have to think of a name for it yay it worked first time i am lucky yay <laughs> i'm happy about that and after this there's only one more and then we've done every single third generation crop which is 
quite impressive, I have to say. <laughs> There's a lot of crops in this game and it takes a long time to create them all as well. So yeah, I'm like, I'm quite proud of myself. <laughs> all right, um, wow, it is like a chicken, but uh, it's a radish. <laughs> Uh, okay, it looks like something out of Mr. Bean. I always remember that episode on Mr. Bean where he gets that chicken stuck on his head. <laughs> and I'll forever, I'll forever think of that because it like, and there's like, there's a thing where there's, isn't there like a dancing chicken? I'm sure I've seen like a video of like a weird dancing chicken thin thing before. It might have been like on a movie or something. I don't know, but it's um kind of disturbing. <laughs> I don't know what to call this thing, man. It literally has like pecs. Look, it literally have pe has pecs. Like, what's up with that? <laughs> I have no idea. I think we should call it Funk because it's funky and I don't know. I feel like it's going to start like dancing and doing weird stuff. So that's why we're going with that. All right, so we're on the last crop now. So this is rare crop number 24, the final one. There are 24 hybrid third generation hybrid crops and this is the last one interesting every combination that i have tried on this website have all made king seeds so i'm sort of wondering if the rare crop number 24 is a king seed or if it's just some kind of like mis mistake or something but yeah i don't seem to be making any headway with that one so i'm not too sure i actually don't know if i have any any happy lamps I actually don't so I won't be able to produce these ones for a while unless uh, I mean we do have one winter crop but yeah like I'm not gonna be able to actually like have these fully grown for for a little bit but like I'm thinking that's all I'm gonna be able to do with the hybrid crops uh, the third generation crops because I just can't seem to get that last one to 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 work it just won't it just won't it just won't be created but that's fine that's fine um so i'm just gonna put all my seeds away for now but yeah we we made a, a nice amount there so that's awesome i'm looking forward to to seeing what they look like once they're like grown and stuff um i can't plant any until the winter time so i'm just gonna need to hold on to some of them for now but we're really getting to the end of all of this like hybridizing and cooking stuff that that we have been doing is so we've been that that's been our goal for for a while so um yeah <laughs> definitely getting to the end of it now and uh, made quite a lot of dishes we've made 69 dishes out of 86 there's really not very many to go i'm gonna see if i can create any now we'll have to see how far we get with that because it's not always easy making dishes in this game they've <laughs> definitely made it complicated or we just don't have enough information on this game which is kind of crazy considering how old this game is but I don't know okay so we're gonna make a new salad uh, basically we need a mellow toma let's hope that this works that's a gritoma so that's not gonna work <laughs> for starters uh, a mellow toma I'm pretty sure I have one there there we go we need a mellow toma we need a dillion and hybrid number two which I'll work out what that is in a second so a dillion and this is why I wanted loads of dillions because I needed a lot um hybrid number two is a rock if I am not mistaken but this website might have different uh, things for number two than what I have so let's see that is not what I was trying to create so that's wrong what if it was a rare tree crop that they were asking for and not a natural crop maybe that's where I went wrong so let me check that <laughs> As I thought they were talking about the rare crop and I got confused. Melotoma Dillion, if it's the tree crop, then it would be a kiwi, I think. Let's let's try that and see if that works instead. Oh, I think that's why it wasn't working. Okay, that is a mellow salad. There we go. It wasn't working because I thought they meant he was just about to eat. I thought they were talking about a rare crop, but it was actually a rare tree crop. Very easy to confuse. <laughs> so that makes a lot of sense. Okay, so we got that recipe done, so that was cool. So we need a tomato, we need special produce. I think, I think I can just use a Rory for that. A Rory should be fine. 
and also a Posa Mello, which I know I have because I made sure that I had some of these. So yeah, we do have one of those. So that's good. Let's hope that this works and it's what I want. All right, let's see. Potomelo salad. Nice. Vegetables with Potomelo. So that's another one that I was that I was actually after. So that's two new salads today, which I'm very happy about. Good progress. So if we go into our categories now, um, the salad, I need one more. The hors de bores are done. So entrees i think entrees are the thing that we need the most of actually yeah we, we actually need a lot of these so this is an entree and we need a tomato so we'll start with a tomato then we need hybrid number five and a mugwort hybrid number five is pea so we'll go and grab pea it's literally like a pod of peas um created it a while ago so i definitely have those there we go there's the pea and also a mugwort so let's shove those together and hope this works <laughs> it did not okay i don't know what i did wrong no rec up number four rec up number four is egg is the eggplant um one. Oh no do i have one i do have one eggplants and mugwort is that right i tried number five and it didn't work it must have oh, okay that was wrong information then it was record up number four and that's why it wasn't working oh my god it actually looks different to like some of the other dishes this is veggie pasta vegetables flavored with mugwort oh very nice very nice i like that it actually has a different it actually looks different <laughs> so that's really cool so that's veggie pasta very nice let's see jeff and an egg right that was the last one yeah an egg let's go with an egg let's see if this works instead yeah there we go there was the wrong one it said because hybrid number 15 for me i wrote down from a different website as tutu but it's actually means something else on this other website it's so confusing but there we go mixed veggies stir fried egg with vegetables very nice. It looks kind of similar to the, um, you know, the last one we made. It looks similar to the veggie pasta. Now we've got mixed veggies. Um, so that's kind of cool. I like that. At least it worked. So that makes me happy <laughs> at the very least. This is a really, really easy one. You just need to put a Jeff into the bowl and hopefully this is com gonna come out right but there you go that was a very very easy one and also a very nice bowl this is a bean bowl made with jeff <laughs> i'm sorry i just can't it's just it's so funny when it comes up saying stuff like that <laughs> this is what makes me just like love this game <laughs> it's, just, it's so stupid I love that they let you make like your own names for like the stuff in this game and then you come out with stuff like this where bean bowl is made with Jeff and I just I just love it it's just it's just amazing um this website is saying that it's actually rare crop number nine which is Fred not what that other website was saying um so I'm gonna try this instead <laughs> let's see if this works that worked okay the other website had the wrong information and this is a mountain bowl wild plants with fred <laughs> fred has some wild plants isn't fred lucky i don't <laughs> i guess so i guess so but yeah that one that one actually did work so that's great that's great I think that's it. I don't think there's anything else I can do right now. Let's see how many recipes I actually made. So today we made one, two, three, four, five, six new recipes. Let me add that on. So that means that we are 75 out of 86 on the recipes, I think. Although some of them I think are not working. Um, so I don't know like <laughs> how much further is left because some of them just do not work some of them are just like wrong information or something because I've tried the combination that they've said on the website and it's just not worked so I, I really <laughs> really don't know but we did manage to make some progress so I'm I'm happy about that because you know it can be a very painful experience sometimes to create recipes on this game so <laughs> Yeah, it's a real pain in the butt. Um, but I, I feel like we made some some decent progress though. So so that's good. That's good. So I mean, I gotta like wash my animals and sort them out and pick up all the produce and stuff like that. Um, I probably I think the next episode we will most likely return in the new chapter because there's not too much going on here. 
I might do it like just before the next chapter so that we can have another go in the dig site to see if we can get that tablet. Um, but yeah, it will be like near enough at the end of the chapter. So uh, we'll have to... We'll have to see how that goes, right? <laughs> so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode though. Thank you so much for watching. I just want to say a huge thank you to all of my Patreons and members for supporting the channel. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. And if you are interested in donating, there will be a link in the description box below to my Patreon page. Alternatively, you can also click on the big join button underneath every video that I create to become a member of the channel. I also do have a live streaming channel where I live stream new releases and all kinds of different types of, of games. So if you're interested in that, you can find it on the channel homepage or you can also find it in the description as well. I hope you enjoyed. Please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time.